Alright, so after reading the Bible and everything, right, I have a possible theory as to why um, things are so different now as compared to back then, right? Think about it, men have multiple women and everything. Men today still think about having multiple women, but women ain't tolerating that. So, I have a theory, which goes back to comparing to the past and the present. I think I forgot to mention it in the earlier video, so I feel like talking about it now. So, um, it's just a small point, just two small points. One, the women were virgins. And two, the men took care of their women, or women's. They took care of every last one of them. All right, so I'm gonna break it down with the women being virgin thing, right? Which means also there was no boyfriend or girlfriend type stuff, but that's like a little minor thing. Mm -hmm. <sighs> the women were virgins. Cool, we get it. What does having to be virgins have to do with anything? It's the level of trust that a woman is literally given the dude in order to penetrate her to go inside her, to be one with her, right? So you got that level of trust that she is placing on you not to just hit it and quit it, all right? So you got that level of trust. And back then, men actually took care of all the women they were messing with, at least from what is written here. Basic saying, if you were considered this man's uh, concubine, wife, mistress, Basically, anything of relation to this man, this man will take care of what is his. So when you add those two together, then it's just like, it doesn't matter if he's going out with multiple women, because at the end of the day, he's taking care of me. You know what I'm saying? So then, you know, and you're not alone on this. So not only... Was she able to give her trust? Because, you know, giving up your virginity brings the trust level to a whole new level. So it's just like, once that is reached, she's placing all of her trust in you and type stuff. You pretty much are creating a whole new bond with her just by taking her virginity, right? And then you're taking care of her. Even if you got other women, and pretty much all the other women are on board too. You know, they're virgins. You're taking all of their virginity. It doesn't matter. They gave you their trust, and you took care of them. That's the only thing I can think of as to how their system worked back then. Men took care of their women. Right, women were virgins, and when you take a woman's virginity, she is placing a certain amount of trust on you. And when you put those two together, then it's just like she's not gonna go really go anywhere because you reinforce that trust, even if you are with another woman. You're still taking care of her. Thus, the whole multiple women thing was, you know, that system was able to be done. While today, it's just all about, let me get this chick. Let me get that chick. No, I'm not going to get this chick. And I think the reason why that played a part is because of the whole boyfriend-girlfriend system. Which pretty much starts in school where relationships really aren't relationships. You don't have the whole real world, you know, getting into the relationship, like how it affects it. Oh, you need this to live off of, you know, because in school, you're still living with your folks. You don't have to really worry financially about things, you know, or have to worry about resources. You know, you just got to be with the girl. 
and that stuff. And the thing about it is, because keep in mind, there was no boyfriend and girlfriend thing back in the day. If you felt like you loved this chick, you took this chick. Let me have your hand in marriage or be one of my girls. You know what I'm saying? And then once you got her, you took care of her all the way. Today, you know, boyfriend, girlfriend, like I said earlier, starts in high school, which kind of gives it a feeling of being like a game because it's like the real world factors aren't included. So you you got the guys going around messing with these girls, taking their virginities, you know what I'm saying? Leaving them, going on to the next. The other girl may or may not be a virgin because some other dude did the same thing. You got this process pretty much going around all the way up. I think what I think some start getting active like some around in middle school, sometime in middle school, like a small percentage, higher percentage uh in high school, especially in college. So, yeah. The boyfriend girlfriend system, you know, pretty much I say it kind of messes up the system a little bit if you start it before you get into like the real world because all you're really doing is getting yourself used to playing around really that's all it is it's just a game so when you put all these factors together it's just like okay so that's the difference between back then and now that's probably why that system was able to work and it doesn't now you know what i'm saying like how was it able to do the things it do this is my perception my thought my view on how I think it was able to do the, you know, the, the system of back then was able to do its thing. Just a, just a thought. All right, I'm out.